Hey guys, what's up? So welcome to episode number two of how to change your Windows machine to a Mac looking theme. And today I'll be teaching you how to get the wallpaper that I use and the Mac cursors. You know, the ones that are black with the rainbow spinning wheel when it's loading. So let's start off with the wallpaper first. You want to go to Google and you want to type in Aurora Leopard. It should be on the first page and I use this one. The link will be on the side, so you can just click on that and wait for that to load up. It's a pretty big wallpaper, so it should fit most screens. And once that's done, you want to right click on it and click Set as Desktop Background. So just click on that and click OK. And there you have it. You have the normal wallpaper that I use in most of my videos. And the second thing that you want to do today is we're going to change the cursor look. So the link will be in the sidebar, and I've uploaded these cursors myself. As usual, just click download file. It's 311 kilobytes, and just click download. You can pay for membership if you want, but if you're smart, you can wait 90 seconds, and you can download it directly on your desktop so once that's done you can cross out of your Firefox or whatever internet browser you use and you should see something called cursors.rar you want to right click on it and click extract here okay so once that's done you should see an extracted folder and you should just double click on that seeing that you have all the cursors that you need. So you can cross that out and you can go into your control panel. Your control panel can be also asked, accessed in start and then you can go to control panel. So once that's open, you can click on the mouse button and you should see something that says pointers. Click on that and you should see your normal based one. Just double click on normal select and go to and go to your extracted folder that you extracted today. Just double click on that and you should see the one that says normal select. So there it is. Help select should be here also and everything is named accordingly. Okay, so once you've had everything selected, you want to click Apply. And there you have it. You have the black cursor, and everything should be working just fine. So this is how you do it, and if you guys like this, stay tuned and stay subscribed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.